Roberto, how are you, bro? How was your weekend? Did you go to the beach? Hello, Frank. I'm good. My weekend? Yeah, it was fine. You don't look fine. What happened? Didn't you go to the beach or what? Yes, I went to the beach. I went with my family. We ate seafood and spent a great time together. We went on Saturday and we stayed there until Sunday. We rented a small house near the beach. Really? That sounds good. I'm planning to go to the beach this weekend. Yeah, you should go. The weather is great and there aren't many people on the beach. I'm sure you will have a great time. I can give you the phone number of the man who rents houses. That's a great idea. Thank you so much. But why are you angry, my friend? Nah, it's nothing. Hey, um, did you finish your report on Friday about the numbers? Yes, I delivered that to the boss on Friday. I suppose he has checked that already. I suppose so. I didn't finish. I have to do it now before the boss arrives. Yeah, you better do that. But you haven't told me yet. Why are you angry? What happened? There is something that bothers me, but... It doesn't matter. How are you? I'm great. I'm studying a master. I want to ask for a pay raise soon. That sounds good. I'm sure you'll get it. You're an intelligent man, so you won't have any problem. Yeah, but you don't look so happy. <laughs> Do you have any problem? No, or yeah. Well, I can't tell you. I want to ask you something. Do you really like working here? I mean, do you enjoy working at this office? Why do you ask me that? Of course, I like working here. Why? Don't you like it? Yeah, I like it. But this job is stressing, right? I mean, it's a demanding job. Well, yeah, that's true, but we learn a lot of things. Well, I do. Of course, because you're very young. You only have two years working here. I have been working here for more than 10 years. I have learned a lot, yeah, but nothing. I suppose so. Why are you telling me that? Aren't you happy with this job or what? No, I'm fine. Or, no, no. Don't you have any problem to wake up in the morning? No, I know we have to wake up early every day. But that's not a problem for me. I see. Well, I suppose I'll see you at lunchtime. Later. Wait, aren't you gonna tell me what is happening here? You are acting very weird, bro. Mm, no, I mean, I'm just tired. There are a lot of things to do, don't you think? Yeah, as always. I mean, we have a lot of things to do 
every day. What happened? Yeah, you're right. Well, have a good day. I'll see you later. I have to work. All right, it's enough. You are going to tell me what the hell is happening here. We are friends, aren't we? Or I suppose we were. Why don't you want to tell me what's going on? I don't think I should tell you something like this. Yeah, we're friends, but there are some things... Okay, I understand. Don't worry, you don't need to tell me. I thought we were friends. No, wait. All right, I will tell you. Yeah, I mean, I'm tired, stressed, sick of this job. Mm, what do you mean? Don't you want to work here anymore? I like working here, but I have learned everything. I need new challenges, you know? Well, that's understandable. You have worked here for 10 years. Yeah, I wake up early every day, come here, work hard, and then go back home. I like what I do, but I need more. I need to learn new things. So I think I will look for another job. Wow, I didn't know you felt that way. So are you going to quit this job then? Yeah, but in the near future. I don't know when it's going to happen, but... I can't quit now. I have a family. I need to work. And the salary here is not bad. I think that's the best decision. Once you find a job, then you could talk to the boss. Exactly. So I will start looking for another job. It can take months, so please don't tell anybody. Are you kidding? Of course I won't tell anyone about your decision. Don't worry. Thank you. Well, I will start with my duties. I'll see you later and thank you. All right, and don't worry. I won't tell anyone about your secret. <laughs> Good morning, Frank. I checked your report. Good job. Keep working hard. Oh, hello, boss. Thank you so much. I always put all my effort on this job. I know. Have you seen Roberto? I have been looking for him, but I can't find him. Oh, maybe he's looking for another job right now. <laughs> no, I mean, uh, Roberto. Roberto? Looking for another job? What do you mean? Is he going to quit? No, of course not. But just to know what will happen if he quits. Well, basically, I will have to look for another supervisor, an experienced worker. Well, maybe he will quit. He told me he's looking for another job. I'm really sorry. Really? He didn't tell me anything. I will fire him before he quits. Damn. Thank you for telling me. You are a good worker. You could replace him once he leaves. See you later. Yeah, all right. I'll see you later, dear boss. You are the best boss ever. Frank, 
I got fired. Did you tell the boss I wanted to quit? Why did you do that? Roberto, I don't know what you're talking about. I have to work. Take care. Wait, don't go. Damn it. I shouldn't have told him anything. You want some advice? Your co-workers are not your friends. Always keep that clear. I hope you liked this conversation. If you could improve your English a little more, please subscribe to the channel and share this video with a friend. And if you want to support this channel, you can join us or click on the super thanks button. Thank you very much for your support. Take care.